Alrighty, today we're looking at uh, another 3DS. This one is disgusting. Absolutely gross. Covered in lots of gamer gunk. Doesn't charge, doesn't boot up. Um, did get it untested, so let's see if it's something major or minor. So start with the basics, of course. Get that back cover off and swap the battery. See if that gives us any um, results. Let's get those four screws off first. Nice and easy, little Phillips head. As long as none of them are stripped, which they aren't. Good stuff. There's a bit of gamer gunk holding this back plate on. There we go. Wait to the side. battery over. The moisture indicator was all clear, which is good, because the liquid damage sucks. Alright, new battery in, still not charging. I'm going to have to open it up further and investigate. So there's quite a few screws on the back there them all out, including the one above the game slot, and when you clamshell it open, careful not to destroy the ribbon cables. So first thing we'll look at, charging port, and it's loose. Those pins are not making a connection with the board at all. So that's pretty easy, straightforward fix. As you can see there, there's only one pin, the, the one on the very far right is the only one making a connection. So probably don't even need to take the board out to do this, we'll just get our flux on there, get the soldering iron and touch up along those uh, points. And I think that should get us charging again, as long as there's nothing else wrong with it. So now that that's secured, let's whack a battery on, give it a quick whirl. Do we get a charging light? Yes, charging light. Yes, well, that's a good start. Get some juice into this battery, and let's see if it boots up. It's good. Ooh, hoo, hoo. okay. Boots up. Circle pad works. Buttons feel alright. Oh, let go of the battery. We'll get this back plate back on, I think, so we can test the L and R button. Because we do get quite a few issues with them. And we'll test the game as well while we're at it. So we know if there's any more work to be done inside while it's all open. Mm, it's taken a few attempts for that game to come up. Third time's a charm. So I'll probably use some contact cleaner for that game slot. Because the pins in there looked alright. And it works. It just took three attempts to get it to work. And that L and R button does not work. I'll check the digitizer. Seems alright. Get it open back up. Check the shoulder buttons. Pins on them look alright. It's probably the actual clicker itself. So in the game slot, those pins look alright too. No corrosion, no bent ones. So get our contact cleaner in there. Give it a psh, 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 psh. if that helps it. The other thing that needs to be swapped is that circle pad it was missing the grey outer layer, it was just a little little plasticky knob. Usually there's a rubber piece on top, so I'll swap that circle pad because I've got a few of them hanging around. 
and internally in there is a pool of gamer gunk as well. This must have been a sweaty, sweaty owner. Previous owner. Clean. New one in there. Where is it? There it is. Got the rubber on top. A little bit of dangly bits around the edge. Okay. That are clean. Probably could have left that plasticky ring in there first and then put the circle pad back in on top. But that worked as well. Give the edge of this thing a clean too. Beauty. Plugged back in. Feels alright. Comes back to the centre. Let's get all this gunk off the outside and everything cleaned off as well while swapping these um, button pads, I think. Let's get these replacement switches in, triggers. Um, so that we can get it all back together and, and make sure everything works alright. So that was the last thing we needed to sort out. Mm, I've got a bit of green around the edge of it, so might have some liquid damage inside, which is why it doesn't work, but. Either way, get that swapped over. Don't pick those little things. Back on. I'll whack that back on the console. 
And here we go. See if it's all happy. Good start. Turns on still. Triggers are working. Excellent. I think that's it for today then. All good. And thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.